Vice President like Mike Pence lectured from the stage by actors on diversity as he sat in to watch the play Hamilton on Broadway. Listen to this, roll tape. We are the diverse America who are alarmed and anxious that your new administration will not protect us. But we truly hope that this show has inspired you to uphold our American values and to work on behalf of all of us. All right, joining us now is Brunel Donald Che, former vice chair, National Diversity Coalition for Donald Trump. God bless you and welcome to the program. I got in before you. So I got you. <laughs> God bless you and God bless America. Yes, Good morning. Yes, indeed, ma'am. Thank you very much. Now, you yes. saw what happened at the play there, Hamilton, the lecture yes. delivered to Mike Pence. Your reaction, please. You know, I realized something. You know, we had a very heated, long, emotional election. And so many Americans whose candidate did not win um, are nervous and worried. And I think that uh, the way Mike Pence handled it, saying that, you know, uh, I believe that he and the, uh, our president-elect are going to include people. I mean, he's just started. The election was only on November 8th. And so what people have to understand is it's a process. It's not overnight. We have got to give them an opportunity to show us and but, paint the true picture. But Brunel, um, do, do you think they Mike realize? Pence and I mean, uh, Donald J. Trump. Look, I, I'm not in a position to say the reaction of the rest of America to what happened at the yes. AMA Awards last night and the, the play on Friday. I'm not in a position to assess that. But I can only imagine that Middle America must be absolutely appalled at this and rather you know angry. What, it, what say you? Yeah. You know what? It it is. It's it, you know. You would feel like look. The election has been won. Donald J. Trump is the vi is the uh, president elect. Mike Pence is the vice president elect. And what we have to do is respect our leaders, respect the people that have been chosen. And you know what's happened is um, people have become entitled. You know it seems. And I think that what we have to do is we've got to have strong leaders, just like the two people that have been elected, to you know put the country on the right track again. And we've got to teach and show people through example who we are. And I think that uh, these two people will do that. I believe their cabinet, as well as all the people that they will pick to lead this nation, will reflect the nation. But you got to at least give them an opportunity to show it, okay. to paint the picture. You Brunel, know, that's important. We appreciate you being on the show all this time. And I hope you'll stay on the show, even though you're the former chair of the Diversity Committee under Donald Trump. We appreciate mm. it. Come and see us again. Thank, Thank you, you so much. God bless you. Thanks for having Got me. Got it. <laughs> Thank you very much <laughs> indeed, Brunel. Right.